Imitation. The instructor shares the knowledge content and demonstrates the skill. Student learning outcome. Students will be able to mimic how to hold the recorder and demonstrate proper technique by blowing with steady stream of air. Students will demonstrate proper fingering to play the notes B, A, and G. <laughs> okay, wait, 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 wait. That's not, that's not toys, those are instruments. Let's, ladies, in your laps, please. Okay, so today we're going to learn how to play the recorder. Sounds like a whistle, right? <laughs> sort of, kind of, but let's wait and play them at the same time, okay? Yeah, set this down for a second. Now, without playing it, just watch. This is the recorder. It's a very, fairly simple instrument. And it just takes light air going through it and very simple fingering. So put your hand in front of your face. And do like a... See, you just a little bit of air. It's just a little too. <laughs> we'll find out. We'll play the instruments. It's okay. Okay. Now pick up your instrument and you'll notice the line of holes in the front and there's one on the back for your fingers. Now you can't look at your fingers. You count from the thumb down. It's one, two, three, four, five. So the one thumb will be on the back hole. And it's, we'll keep it there the whole time. And then the fingers will go down the front. Two is on the top hole. Three is on the next hole. Then four is on the below. Where do we hold it on the bottom? That's what I'm getting to next. We're not going to use the bottom holes at the moment. So we're just going to hold the bottom, not twist it. We're just going to hold it gently, okay? So, like this. Okay, show me what you got. Okay, that looks fabulous. Okay, now to blow in it, just do it very light. Light. <laughs> now, this is what happens when you put a little bit too much air through. If you put too much air in, it's going to squeak. Similarly, that hole in the back, it tells you to keep your thumb there. If you don't have that closed completely, it's also going to squeak. So, you see here, these are our first notes. I'm going to start with all three on the first one. And this is G. Okay? It's on the second line from the bottom. Fingers in position and blow it. Okay, you guys do it. Okay, maybe a little bit more confidently this time. Okay, ladies, this is not a game. Okay, let me do it once more and then you'll cut me, okay? Manipulation. Students reproduce activity from instruction or memory with the instructor's guidance. Student learning outcome. Students will be able to reproduce the recorder techniques, proper fingering and proper form, taught last class with help from the instructor. Okay ladies, now we've been through all three notes that we're going to be using for our song. So let's see if you guys can recognize and play the proper notes. So let's start with the A. Not quite. Hold your quarters. See, the A here has the top two holes oh, two. covered. So you have oh, the three. Two. Oh, and you had one. So that's place. Okay. Okay. So let's try it together. 
together to make sure all our notes match. Okay? One, two, three. Very good. Okay. Let's do B. See the fingers correct. Let's try it together. Yeah. So let me see where you have your fingers. Now let's see the G, that's the board, has the top three holes. So let's do it again. Okay, so let's just do them in order as they're on the board. G. Precision. Students execute skills reliably, independent of help. Activity is quick, smooth, and accurate. Student learning outcome. Students demonstrate understanding of recorder skills by applying skills to rhythmic concepts with minimal pitch mistakes. Hello ladies, it looks like you're enjoying your recorders. Do you have any time to practice outside class? Great. <laughs> well, let's try with our mouths first, and let's review what we learned at the last class. Okay. Can you play a B for me today? Fabulous. How about an A? And the G? Since a little competition here still, um, we're going to be giving you a song today. But let's work on. Remember how when we started with the two, two, two with the sound? Well, that's how you make the difference in in notes. So let's pick the G and do some quarter notes. this time. <laughs> and let's do them together, okay? One, two, three, four. Articulation. Students adapt and integrate expertise to satisfy a new concept or task. Student learning outcome. Students apply knowledge of recorder techniques to practice hot cross buns. Wow. <laughs> it was good. Yeah. 
Naturalization. Students demonstrate the skill is instinctive and effortless by showing unconscious mastery of activity and related skills at a strategic level. Student learning outcomes. Students are able to indicate their understanding of the recorder by playing hot cross buns with no errors. Here you go. I can play mom with my nose. <laughs> the key player's in tune. Okay, where's the teacher? Maybe she won't show up. Maybe she won't. <laughs> you can't play with your nose, I can play with my nose. Wanna bet? You wanna watch? No, watch me bet. first. Start on the right note. Why can't we play my crossbow? I'm actually not a major plot twist. I can't read or play any kind of instrument whatsoever. <laughs> Let's try this again. One, two, three, four. Did we get, did we cover everything?